I'm uh, Chris Smith. I'm with Laser Helmets. Laser is actually the oldest and most experienced helmet manufacturing company in the world. Been established since 1919. Uh, we've been in uh, bicycle helmets for the last 25 or 30 years. And uh, I'd like to talk to you about a couple of new uh, models that we have uh, specific for the road. First is the Helium. This is our new high-end road helmet for 2010. Cosmetically very similar to our uh, uh, successful Genesis helmet. Slightly bigger shell, slightly bigger uh, air vents on the helmet. So ultimately there's less material on this helmet, better airflow uh, through the helmet to keep the head cool. Additionally, you can see we're using a dual density foam on this helmet. So areas of the foam which are less critical for the protection of the head, we're using a lighter weight, uh, 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 less dense foam, reduce the overall weight of the helmet. Uh, the uh, rigidity brace system, which is molded into the foam, uh, which is nylon on our other helmet models, is actually carbon on this model. So uh, again, uh, ultimately a lighter weight helmet. And then it'll come with uh, the uh, ecstatic padding, which is an antibacterial pad system, uh, self-cleaning, so the helmet's always fresh and ready to go uh, each time you're ready to ride. Uh, we're going to be using a, a lighter weight. This isn't a, an example of it, but there'll be a lighter weight uh, a strap system with some uh, lighter weight uh, chin and uh, uh, adjustable buckles on the side. The goal is to make this helmet as lightweight as possible while still providing the excellent fit system that we have with the, uh, the Rolsys uh, 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 fit system. So very lightweight, very comfortable, very easy to fit this helmet. Uh, and this is uh, the Helium, our new high-end helmet for 2010. Okay. Uh, this is our new uh, Aero helmet for 2010. It's actually available now in the United States. It's the TARDIS. Uh, one of the biggest problems you have with Aero helmets is uh, uh, overheating, lack of sufficient airflow through the helmet. Uh, the problem is once the head overheats, it tells the rest of the body that it's overheating, you start to lose bioperformance-wise any, uh, any benefit that you would have with an aerodynamic helmet. So the goal with this is to keep the rider's head cool. We accomplish that through vents in the front of the helmet, vents in the rear of the helmet, which actually creates an active airflow system through the helmet. So you constantly have air flowing through this helmet. Additionally, the uh, laser aqua vent technology, which allows you to take your water bottle and put water into the, uh, the top of the head, or into the top of the helmet, which is distributed over the top of the head through the foam, which is uh, water distribution channels are molded into the foam of the helmet and then the ecstatic pad system has perforations designed into it to distribute the water over the surface of the head so between the active airflow system pulling air constantly through the helmet and the evaporative benefits of water over the head helps keep the head very cool in the uh, the TARDIS aero, uh, aero helmet. Uh, aerodynamic benefits of this helmet uh, uh, dual layer aerodynamics the front and side surface of the helmet are the gloss material, and the back uh, uh, area of the helmet is a matte finish with the golf ball dimples. So we actually create a, a, a layer of air on the back of the helmet, which is traditionally an a, a area of, of turbulence on aero helmets. So as the air approaches the helmet, breaks over the top and the side surface, uh, it encounters this layer of air and just slips right off the back of the helmet. So uh, uh, very aerodynamic as well as being uh, cool and comfortable to wear. A, uh, a specific benefit for triathlon is our roll fit system. Again, very quick and very easy to adjust the, uh, the fit of this helmet with just one finger of one hand. So uh, coming out of T1 transition, put the helmet on your head, adjust it under, uh, 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 snap the, uh, the, the chin buckle, get the bike up to speed and just reach up very quickly and very easily adjust the final fit of this helmet. The helmet will be positioned perfectly on the rider's head. You'll get all the maximum benefits of uh, aerodynamics with the TARDIS with no problems of uh, overheating. That's the TARDIS Aero Helmet, new from uh, Laser Helmets for 2010.